Doug's, Douglas Locken is a student that has Leforis epilepsy. They, it's commonly known as Leforis. Only 11 people in the United States have that, and only 200 people in the entire world have this condition. So there's not very much research that uh, that's done, that has been done. There's one person in UCLA, one doctor that has taken on this cause. Um, and what it is, is a very severe form of epilepsy, which causes people to have seizures. My favorite thing about Doug is how even though he has this condition, he still gets up every day and comes to school and tries as hard as he can, and he's always really positive about everything. Douglas was born Douglas Jacob Luckin on April 27th of 1992 at Naval Air Station, Lamar, California. He has been always a cute little guy, curly hair, white, just white toe-headed hair, very much into trucks, trailers, and bikes. As he progressed and got older, he was into BMX bikes, he worked on them, he jumped them. He's always been into school. School's always been his favorite thing, he's never missed a day. He, that's always been his favorite pastime. He loves his friends, he loves his family. He's got a great sense of humor, for example. Uh, he would wad up pieces of paper in my office and he'd shoot hoops in the, the wastebasket or he would um, just crack little funny jokes here and there and try to make people laugh. Um, he was very friendly with other people, saying hello and smiling. Um, I know he's very into NASCAR and racing, so he would talk a lot about those kind of things too. He was always really happy and he was laughing and he was running around all the time and he always tried to make people around him just as happy as he was. My favorite memory of Doug is no matter what, we could just like hang out and just do whatever. Like it could be the most boringest of things and we'll just make it fun. Like it was like we could play this stupid game and all of a sudden, hey, this is fun. Like, we're really enjoying this. And, like, he was kind of like a brother to me. Like, we've known each other most of our lives. Um, Doug was diagnosed with what's called Leforis disease, and it's a progressive um, form of epilepsy that today is not treatable. Um, and it's only affected 11 people in the United States and 200 worldwide. So it's a very rare um, form of epilepsy. And uh, the life expectancy is not past 25. But recently, there's been some research done by a neurologist, and we're hopeful that um, gentamicin therapy will reverse the effects of the disease and um, help Doug to live longer. And to be seizure free. So we're very hopeful that this gene therapy will come through for Doug. Doug's Daily Dollar is a, a fundraiser that we started here at Lamore High School to raise awareness first of all for, for this disease and secondly to try to raise money. Um, because there's only 11 people in the United States um, there hasn't been really any research like cancer or, or some other uh, disease that, we're, that we all know. There's millions and millions of dollars being raised for, the, for those diseases, for research, for therapy. But in this particular case, um, there's only one doctor at UCLA who's doing um, a gene therapy um, research, but it's very expensive. It's $30,000 of treatment, and it's never, been, um, it's never been attempted on humans, only in mice. And with, uh, with it being so expensive um, at Lamore High School, we, tried, we are raising uh, money for Doug. And so our goal is to raise $10,000 by, by having our students and our staff and people in the community give $1 a week for five weeks. The way you know we are is we always teach him that you know he's, he's a gung-ho, he's a go-getter, he's a fighter, and he won't let his body give up. And school is his thing, and no matter what kind of day he has, school is where he wants to be. That's his favorite thing to do.